Hey guys, today I'm going to show you the highlights and the finishing results from race two of the NASCAR Gillette series, the Valvoline Dirt Derby at Selma Raceway. So to start things off, Julius Anderson got the pole for the race. And he got a good start, leading most laps. And so the first caution came out on lap 12, collecting five cars, which are Andy Fonseca, Chase Powers, who actually climbed the wall, Crystal Elmore, was also in it. Same thing with Dalton Bowman and Larson Rothling, who kind of got on his side. And also, Brandon Shaw and Donnie Owens had damage from the wreck as well, but they got repairs and were able to continue. Owens finished 11th, while Shaw finished 13th. But then the next caution was a big one. Came out on the final lap of stage one, which was lap 50. And it collected John Gambit, Cherie Spells, who, ne who nearly got into the catch fence, but she went for a ride. And Ryan Monaco has lots of had lots of damage, excuse me, to his Oreo Chevrolet. Robert Smith was also in it. Rhett Standingwater was in it, as well as Dylan Baptista, Lee Williams, Matthew Ingleroom, who didn't have a lot of damage. He was able to continue. Felipe Silva. Logan Drailing, who made his debut, I mean debut, excuse me. Then Eli Bright, Junior Lee. Both Lees were in this crash, as well as Gavin Day and Connor Johns. And Rhett Standingwater, if I haven't said his name. This crash put out the red flag. And debris was all over the place after the crash. And so Jeff Bright won. Excuse me. Sorry, my fingers got in the way. But anyways, Jeff Bright won the first stage. But the next caution didn't come out until lap 87 were... Connor Zola spun out and hit the wall hard. And he also took out the 93 of Peyton Beasley. So that ended their days. And it was a close finish for stage two. And Julius Anderson ended up winning it. And Eric Monaco finished second. In stage two, Carl Yaley finished third, Cody Ballard finished fourth, Josh Don finished fifth, Lyman sixth, Bright, Jeff Bright to be exact, in seventh, Jonas eighth, Richard Van Dyke ninth, and Spencer Jones in tenth. And I forgot to show you the results for. Stage one, and I'm going to show you them right now. As here's a look at the rest of the stage one results. And now here are the results from stage one. 
so sorry about that. My mom got a notification on her phone, but anyways, Jeff Bright won stage one, followed by Aiden Colwell. I'm just going to do this quick. Thomas Rothling, Carl Ailey, Chloe Ballard, Julius Anderson, Connor Zola, Tom Jolis, Josh John, Ricky Cooper, Eric Monaco, Tyler Lyman, Peyton Beasley, Michelle Wilcox, Anthony Clark, Richard Van Dyke, Donnie Owens, Spencer Jones, then Matthew Ingram, and finally Brandon Shaw. Then on lap 111, Aiden Colwell and Spencer Jones tangled up, bringing out yet another caution, ending both of their days. Colwell started second. He had such a good car. Same thing with Spencer Jones. Except he started 19th. And here's the finish. Cody Ballard ended up winning the race. Julius Anderson got a good second place finish. And there was a wreck on the final lap. Anthony Clark took a hard hit. And he is okay after taking that hard hit. He got turned by Ricky Cooper in the 11 car, but not intentionally. Now let's have a look at the results. So, finishing first, Cody Ballard. Second, Julius Anderson. Third, Thomas Rothling. Fourth, Carl Yaley. Fifth, Jeff Bright. Ain't that weird how the number five car finished fifth? Then 6th is Richard Van Dyke. 7th is the only finishing Monaco brother, Eric Monaco. Then we got Tom Jonas, Tyler Lyman, Matthew Ingleroom, Donnie Owens. Just ignore the duct tape that's repair stuff. That's damage repair. Excuse me. And Michelle Wilcox. Then Brandon Shaw. Ricky Cooper. Then rounding out the top 15 is Josh Dawn. Then we got Anthony Clark, who took a hard hit in Colwell. From. 16th to last are DNF cars. So they, they didn't finish. Anyways, 16th Anthony Clark, like I said. 17th in Cole, in Colwell. 18th Spencer Jones. 19th Connor Zola. 20th Peyton Beasley. 21st Sheree Spells. 22nd Connor Johns. 23rd John Gambit. 24th, Gavin Day. 25th, Red Standing War. 26th, that is Robert Smith. 27th, Ryan Monaco. 28th, Dylan Baptista, who is now in a Chevrolet. And we got Logan Drailing. There's first start. Not a good finish. Then Eli Bright, Lee Williams, Junior Lee, Felipe Silva, Crystal Elmore, Dalton Bowman. Then Andy Fonseca. Then Larson Rothling. And last but not least, Chase Powers. And only 38 cars entered the race. So here are the results. And so congratulations to Cody Ballard 
and the Roush Fenway Racing number 16 team on your first win. Have a nice day, everyone. This is, excuse me, sorry about the finger. This is Jonathan Mick signing out.